I'm about to reveal the shocking truth behind why we currently have stage six load shedding and why we could possibly go to stage eight. So if you think this is because of capacity issues, you would be wrong. It is in fact because of wage negotiations. Yes, believe it or not, it is because wage negotiations have fallen apart between ESCOM and NUMSA. So what exactly do workers want? Well, before we get into what they want, let's talk about some ESCOM salary facts. ESCOM currently has 44,772 thousand employees and you're not going to believe this the average salary at escom is 737 thousand rand per year yes folks that's right 61 thousand rand per month is the current average salary at escom and get a load of this the ceo currently earns 7 million rand per year that equates to 583 thousand rand per month and if that wasn't enough the current employee benefits paid out by escom totals a whopping 33 billion rand per year that makes escom the fourth best paying employer in the country and if that's not enough to get your blood boiling let's talk about inflation versus escom's tariff increases if we look at the period from 2007 to 2021 the current inflation increase has been 134 percent whereas escom's tariff increases has been a whopping 753 percent so now let's talk about some of those demands now that we know that escom is officially the fourth best paying employer in the country what exactly could these employees be demanding well numsa's demands includes double digit percentage increases on those salaries they're also looking for the CEO to be removed as well as some other key positions. Uh, maybe they should be asking for their salaries to be halved. I think that would be a really good call. Looking at the vehicle subsidies, they want those to be doubled for employees. They're also looking for housing subsidies to be doubled. They're also looking for an increase in maternity leave. And they also want 80% contributions for medical aid. And if that was not enough, there are an additional 52 demands. By the way, ESCOM offered 7% and that was rejected. And because of that, employees have been striking and burning and carrying on. And that, folks, is why you have rolling blackouts and you currently have stage six load shedding. Now, as I promised, I've got ESCOM firmly in my sights. I am extremely angry at what's been going on and I'm gonna be exposing every little rat in the stable. So make sure you follow me. I'm gonna be bringing lots more content like this and I'm gonna be opening up a serious can of worms. So make sure you are following my profile. Also, make sure you share this post. The only way we can change things is by educating people around us. Hit that share button, share it with everybody here on TikTok, share it on WhatsApp and share it on all your other social media profiles. This is super important, folks. If we do not share this post, we cannot get this information out. And then last but not least, leave me a comment and let me know exactly what you think.